Introduction, welcome to the charming town of Mayberry, where life unfolds at a leisurely pace and laughter is abundant. In the early 1960s, a television series emerged that would capture the hearts of viewers across America and become an enduring classic, The Andy Griffith Show. Created by Sheldon Leonard and Danny Thomas, this delightful sitcom first premiered on October 3, 1960, and ran for eight seasons until April 1, 1968. Set in the fictional town of Maybury, the show revolved around the life of Sheriff Andy Taylor and his lovable cast of characters, bringing forth a blend of humor, warmth, and timeless values that continues to resonate with audiences to this day. Why is the Andy Griffith show so popular? This endearing TV series achieved remarkable popularity and has stood the test of time for several reasons. First and foremost, the show's wholesome and relatable content appealed to a wide audience, transcending generations. It provided a glimpse into small town life where neighbors looked out for one another and problems were resolved with a dose of wit and wisdom. Central to the show's success was the brilliant performance of its lead actor, Andy Griffith who portrayed the wise and kind-hearted Sheriff Andy Taylor. Griffith's portrayal of the compassionate sheriff, dispensing fatherly advice to his son Opie and navigating the quirks of the townsfolk, earned him immense admiration and love from the viewers. Additionally, the dynamic chemistry between Andy Griffith and his on-screen sidekick, the bumbling but lovable Deputy Barney Fife, played by the talented Don Knotts, added an extra layer of humor and warmth to the show. Their comedic interactions and genuine friendship became the backbone of the series, leaving an indelible mark on television history. Fondly remembered actors and actresses, apart from Andy Griffith and Don Knotts, the Andy Griffith show featured a talented ensemble cast that brought Maybury to life. Francis Bavier portrayed the beloved Aunt B, Andy's caring and no-nonsense aunt who brought a maternal presence to the show. Ron Howard, who later became a renowned filmmaker, played the role of Andy's son, Opie Taylor, capturing hearts with his endearing innocence. Other notable actors who made appearances in the show included George Lindsay as Goober Pyle, Jim Nabbers as Gomer Pyle, and Annette Corsout as schoolteacher Helen Crump, who later became Andy's love interest. Do you have any fond memories of The Andy Griffith Show? As we reminisce about this beloved series, it's hard not to feel a rush of nostalgia. For many, The Andy Griffith Show was a source of comfort, a refuge from the stresses of everyday life. It offered lessons on kindness, community, and the importance of family bonds, all wrapped up in heartwarming humor. Perhaps you remember the episodes where Barney Fife's quirky schemes would land him in hilarious predicaments, or how Aunt Bee's delicious pies became the talk of the town. Or maybe Sheriff Andy Taylor's wisdom and unwavering moral compass left a lasting impression on your values. No matter your memories, The Andy Griffith Show remains a timeless classic that continues to bring joy to countless viewers, even years after its original run. So, sit back, relax, and journey back in time to the idyllic town of Maybury, where life was simpler and laughter echoed through every corner. The Andy Griffith Show is not just a TV series, it's a cherished piece of Americana that has left an enduring mark on television history. In the quaint town of Maybury, The Andy Griffith Show came alive in 1960, led by the talented Andy Griffith. Initially aiming to be the central funny character, Andy's plans shifted as Don Knotts' lovable deputy Barney Fife stole the audience's hearts. Recognizing the show's success depended on a perfect ensemble, Andy selflessly embraced Don Knotts as the main comic figure, becoming Barney's straight man. Their chemistry became the heart of the series, endearing them to generations of viewers. The show's charm lay in its humor and the genuine camaraderie among the cast. Andy and Don's real-life friendship shone through, creating moments of laughter and tenderness that resonated with audiences. The Andy Griffith Show became a cultural phenomenon, capturing the essence of small-town America and timeless values like friendship and compassion. Andy's decision to share the spotlight with Don Knotts turned the series into a classic, a respite from the chaos of the world, where viewers found solace in the heartwarming tales of Maybury. Their collaboration and selflessness crafted a masterpiece that continues to bring joy to audiences worldwide. Next time you watch The Andy Griffith Show, remember the genius of Andy Griffith's graciousness and Don Knotts' comedic flair. Together, they etched their names into television history forever. In the quaint town of Maybury, Sheriff Andy Taylor and Deputy Barney Fife formed an iconic duo known for friendship, humor, and patrolling in their trusty Ford Galaxy. 
The car's vibrant hues matched their personalities perfectly, adding to the charm of their adventures. The Ford Galaxy's presence on the show was part of its realism as local dealers supplied the newest models. Each car had its unique role, mirroring the characters' lives. The Ford Galaxy wasn't just a vehicle, it became a cherished piece of nostalgia for fans, symbolizing a simpler era of kindness and strong bonds. Throughout the series, 10 Galaxies played a pivotal role, captivating generations of viewers. Its journey continued beyond the show, as retired cars were refurbished and found new owners, connecting Maybury to the real world in a delightful way. As the Ford Galaxy weaved its way into the Andy Griffith Show's fabric, it left an indelible mark on television history, a testament to the enduring power of storytelling. The car's engine sound and classic design evoke fond memories of Andy and Barney's escapades, transporting us back to a time when life was enjoyed one delightful moment at a time. In the quaint town of Maybury exists a delightful character, Mr. Schwen. Though not central in the Andy Griffith show, he leaves an indelible mark on hearts. Played by a talented actor, his silent presence speaks volumes. He symbolizes the Everman, observing events with subtlety. Others warmly acknowledge him, creating an unspoken bond that resonates. His appeal extended beyond the show, appearing in two episodes of Gomer Pyle, USMC. Mr. Schwamp's allure lies in his enigmatic nature, leaving viewers to imagine his backstory and aspirations. He embodies the subtleties of human life and the untold stories that shape individuals and communities. Despite not having lines, his impact on the show's essence was profound. He reminded us of the beauty and simplicity, the power of a smile, and the significance of acknowledging others. So, in the nostalgic world of classic series, keep an eye out for Mr. Schwamp, and with a warm greeting, discover the true essence of humanity, the beauty of connecting without words. In the quaint town of Maybury, life moved at a leisurely pace. The county hospital was cherished, where nurses Mary and Peggy played vital roles. Mary's warm demeanor comforted patients, while Peggy fearlessly tackled challenges. They formed an unstoppable duo, supporting each other inside and outside the hospital. Through joys and challenges, they remained dedicated to their community, touching hearts along the way. In the Andy Griffith show, their legacy lives on, inspiring kindness and compassion. Their impact reminds us that simple acts of care can make a significant difference. Mary and Peggy may have left Maybury, but their spirit endures, a timeless reminder of love and selflessness. In the quaint town of Maybury, the fish and hole held a special charm, a delightful invitation to the endearing characters' lives. The TV series, The Andy Griffith Show, transported viewers to a carefree, joyous place. The tunes whistling, courtesy of Earl Hagen, became synonymous with the show, resonating in millions of hearts. Sheriff Andy Taylor and his son Opie shared life lessons and laughter at the fish and hole, symbolizing the show's values, kindness, compassion, friendship, and humor. Hagen's musical brilliance extended beyond whistling. His enchanting compositions made Maybury feel like home. The Andy Griffith show left a lasting legacy in television history. The enduring tune of the fish and hole evokes nostalgia, connecting generations. It continues to be cherished by new audiences, passing on the joy and wisdom of the timeless series. Savor the sweet memories of Mayberry, the soothing whistling, and the heartwarming lessons. Let's raise a toast to Everett Sloan and Earl Hagen, whose creations enriched our lives and made us believe in the magic of Mayberry.